Well, hey there, team. Welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to a bit more Hard Space Ship Breaker. We're still on our main save. We're at 727 million. I've gone and I've dug through all the comms things off of the channel, and that got us a good 1300 LT. Um, and to be honest, that's nothing for what we need right now. We'll just take a quick check of our equipment. Couldn't hurt to repair that. And then we're going to go back in to that same shift on this gecko that we were sort of going through. Now, I was kind of keen. <coughs> Excuse me. Utility keys plenty. A big part of this was, like, to, to fine-tooth comb the, the pulling this apart. But, you know, broadly speaking, at least for a shift's worth of work, now, this has been very straightforward stuff, you know, pretty, pretty Gucci so far. So I think uh, we're just going to keep following the IKEA instructions. I mean, but who reads those anyway? Oh my god! Like, look, I'm a man, flesh and blood, right? I like to have a drink and I like to ignore uh, insults. Uh, in the insults, what instructions? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I guess it starts with I. Um, and I've, I've had my share of building bloody IKEA tables and sofas and that out of, uh, with, without the instructions. Now, generally speaking, I'll just use the instructions, right? Because it's more trouble than it's worth. But all it's going to take, all it's going to take is someone to go, do it, pussy. <laughs> build, it's like, oh, boys, guess what? I've got an IKEA table or something. I'm going to build this. It's going to be great. Oh, you wouldn't do it without building the instructions? Well, that's it. Book me in for a, you know, a slab of beer and uh, and a, a chair that's never going to work right. <laughs> oh, man. I actually, I don't know. Like, Ikea always had a stigma of being like, you know, kind of trash, I guess. I'm just, I'm just talking about the stigma around it, you know, because it was just a symbol. It wasn't sort of bespoke furniture, right? But, um... You know... I'm I'm the stereotype of men only want one thing, and it's... Wait, why do you want to go into the furnace? Oh. I'm I'm the stereotype of men only want one thing, and it's disgusting, to live in a box and do... and, you know, and own nothing. Is it gonna register that? <laughs> Good thing I checked. Yeah, so like, Ikea is a dream come true for a dude that has absolutely no care about any of that sort of crap. I guess, I guess with Sheila's I can understand it. You know, they like pretty things and that sort of stuff. But like... I live a really minimalist lifestyle. Is it because I'm a minimalist? Because I know that that's a thing that you can do. No, it's because I'm just a dude. <laughs> I just don't have anything hanging around. I don't care. I don't have pictures. Or, you know, I just don't care. Why? What am I going to, you know? But look, each to their own, all right? I am leading into the stereotypical sort of yobbo, bloody bogan thing. What is that thing doing? Oh, wait, it's because it's not supposed to be down there. Yeah. I don't really care for fancy things, you know? But I like video games. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Okay, hang on. We were sort of over here. This could be problematic. Is that all, like, attached? Looks like it is, isn't it? Alright, let's do a bloody inspection. Let's, uh, let's walk the routes, boys. It's like working in industry. Does this, uh, come away? Like, oh no, no, this is one large piece, isn't it? Valuable object process. Credit deposited. What is going on with this? Oh, that's kind of cute. It's like, uh, Minnie Mouse's bow. There is a weird reference. Alright. Let's do that way. Can we put you in, mate? Are you willing to go, sir? Probably not. Okay, hang on. How about now? How do you feel about it now? Oh. Credit awarded. 
Interesting answer. The boy was just like me. Now I think these rails next to me are kind of flammable. That's why I'm terrified of them. Okay. Just falls straight away, doesn't it? Oh, right, now where's this one to go? Processor. Okay. We can do that. Way to slingshot it into the furnace. Alright. A lot of the time I drift away like that because like I, I was watching it happen. So I wasn't really paying attention to where I was personally flying. Okay, so... So how's this work out? This wants to go to the processor, and this wants to go to the processor. So why on earth would I want to separate them? Oh, why is my laser glinting all over everything? Oh, I don't, I don't like that. Maybe that's going to separate it out? Oh, this is hard to tell. I haven't really looked at the upper shell. How much do you weigh? Five and a half kilos. Five and a half thousand kilos. Yeah, this wants to go there as well. Yeah, I'm really trying to get to the bottom of this. Like, if I can do this in one big old piece, that'd be wonderful, wouldn't it? Oh, you know what? It's still attached here. Maybe. It's moving. There we go, it's moving. It's working! Yeah, that wants to go on the processor, the rail guide. Hang on, okay, so that's pulled away. Look at that thing go. Uh, uh, uh. That feels good, sending that off. Alright, what about you, mate? What's this on the end? Nothing. Oh, you're going to take the rail too, are you? Fuck it. You can have the rail. Mate, if it wants to go. Looks like uh, the Enterprise. See, it's got its pair of nacelles out the back, or nacelles, or however the bloody hell we say it. Okay, cool. I guess we're getting there. I guess I can just pull that off. Oh, she's heavy. This is good to have this opportunity, you know? Uh! Oh, don't touch the coolant. Oh, the coolant pipe's not popping in. I was like, why is there disconnected coolant? Okay, thank you, ma'am. Now, this is aluminium above us. You interested in that? Oh, yeah, you are. What is this? What is this? Salvage 
deposit accepted. Credit transferred. Oh look, this whole thing wants to go, doesn't it? Maybe if I just make it a bit easier. What do you mean deposit not accepted? 400 kilos of aluminium? No! I've made a baboo. Hang on, how'd that happen? <sighs> the waste! Got about five minutes left in this shift. Oh, it might have been... Might have been something attached to the external? I don't know. Oh man, I'm do I'm doing work on this ship, hey. Uh safe and sorry, let's go this way. Safe and sorry, nearly kills himself. Warning. Your oxygen reserves are dropping below statistically profitable levels. Object accepted for processing. Credit deposited. Processor. Yeah, this rail wants to go on the processor. Alright. Oh, this music gets my waters going. Alright. Oxygen. Tethers. Fuel. Let's go. Give me it all. We made of money over here. This is all going quite well, isn't it? Alright, nice. Very good. Let's go and send that over there. Just getting dangerously close to the furnace up this back end, you know? Don't like it. Mate, this is some serious chunks of metal. Right there. You reckon this ship's ready for flight? You know? I think not. Now this is interest- this is all gonna be very interesting here. Alright, well I've definitely disconnected everything, right? So, straight up, let's pull this thing straight out the centre. Are you willing to go, sir? Okay. Da -da -da. Oh, this has got a bit of a straight shot out here. Salvage deposit accepted. Credits transferred. Yes, ma'am. Salvage 
salvage secured. Account credit applied. Don't do it. Thank you. Salvage secured. Credits deposited. Never doubted. Salvage secured. Account credit. You know what? We'll leave that attached. We'll leave that attached. I think that's a dangerous. Let's not have it floating around. 2.9 million. Again? Not so bad. I su I should be taking note. Please help me take note, team. Take note of how much I'm earning, and then we'll we'll weigh it against how many shifts it takes me, and then we'll we'll come up with a bloody grand total. What's going on here? Let's have a have a squiz. Sensor away, ninety grand. Yeah, ante the antenna eighteen each. That adds up very fast. And another. Oh, okay. Another keel by. Okay, they've just got. They're all just called keel, not keel A B C. Airlock console by three. See, that's so much. Lots of nanocarbon. The cargo hatch off the roof was 150. Jeez Louise. Oh my god. Rail guide. It counts as 18. I guess it's counting all those little segments, but a third of a million dollars for all that rail crap. Easy. It's pretty fragile, I think, as well. And the heat sinks are 130 grand. There's definitely some serious shit in there. A fuel tank. Wait, one fuel tank? One fuel tank was 50 grand. Are you kidding me? That's actually a lot. Well, I guess it's about the same as a, a panel. I kind of assume it was less. I think the coolant's less, which is why I might have done exactly that. So far, we haven't failed any of these, I don't think. So we're still just chipping away, but we're playing the long game. You know, we're playing that longer sort of investment, I suppose. And then, uh, and then I guess chip that money out. Sure. Okay. Why not? Sounds good. Team, like I said, we're just doing the one shifts per episode. A bit more bite size, but, you know, we'll, we'll have them coming out at the same sort of rate anyway, so it's all the same. Thanks again for joining me. We might just leave it there for the time being, and I will catch you guys on the next one.